Hey everybody, Joe Daniels here. Swing this kettlebell in strength. Just drinking some matcha tea. Uh, we got a wonderful question that a lot of people probably haven't thought about. Uh, one was asked several times the other night in our nutrition forum at the gym. Basically, pre-workout nutrition. Not talking about supplements, but talking about what to eat beforehand. And someone said protein shake. Um, so, yeah, cool, awesome. But the thing is, then the question became, how long can I prepare this? I really, it comes down to a couple different things. Um, protein, anything, it's just going to start breaking down. Obviously, you have smelled uh, a shaker bottle that you've left unwashed for, you know, the night. It's uh, not not the best. And you probably smelled one you've left in your car for a week. It's viably disgusting. Um, so, to me, it's basically, those protein, it's protein starts breaking down. Um, I would probably make one no longer than the night before if I was going to train in the morning, shake them up, you know, mix it up if you want. But come on, really, does it take that long to shake up some powder and water? But anyway, uh, if you're adding fruit and you're adding other things, you got to remember there's certain enzymes that are going to be in that um, that might affect. So fruit, certain fruits, strawberries will definitely affect uh, protein, you know. There, there's science in there, and we can pull up some studies and stuff at the bottom, but I'm not going to get into it right now. Uh, I don't know them off the top of my head, but I'm sure they're out there. Anyway, the biggest thing I thought of was, hold on a second, mouth's a little dry. What the pug? Anyway, the the biggest thing that jumped in my mind was some protein uh, manufacturers add a protease, which is basically a protein digesting enzymes, an enzyme that breaks down protein for, you know, better absorption or it's just um, certain things like this. You notice at pineapple has bromelain in it. Bromelain is a protease. Uh, pap papaya has papain in it. It's a, you'll see these at health food stores that help digest uh, protein. So some people, you know, maybe a little extra help with digestion. They, but anyway, some supplement companies will add proteases to their protein uh, jar, you know, whatever, mix or whatever you call it, their protein proprietary blend. Uh, so if you mix that up and let it sit, even for a couple hours, it, it's going to be it, usually a sour, kind of funky taste, uh, smell. It's usually the taste that's off-putting. But anyway, so think about that. Check and see if there's enzymes, uh, protein digestant enzymes in your protein mix before you go sitting it out for a couple hours, even in the refrigerator. Anyway, so it's something that people don't really, I, I don't see people talking talking about or bringing to others' attention, especially newer people. So anyway, check that out as far as proteases breaking down your protein mix.